Hello and welcome. I'm John Callahan from Pachoni's Jewelers in Cleveland, Ohio, and today we're looking at the Christoph Clore Mistoso. Upon initial inspection, the Mistoso appears to be without a complication. While technically that is true, there are no complications in the traditional sense. No date date, no chronograph, no minute repeater. The Mistoso does in fact feature a very complicated movement construction, which is a deton escapement. Now a deton escapement is very rarely used in wristwatches. In fact, only two brands that I'm aware of use this type of escapement in a wristwatch. The reason deton escapements are not used more frequently in wristwatch is because they are extremely sensitive to impact. Because deton escapements are so delicate, Christoph had to come up with several inventions in which to secure and stabilize the movement. The deton escapement is in fact quite an achievement in itself. Christoph took it a step further, implemented a force constant differential that allowed for consistent timing throughout the entire power reserve. The aesthetics of the Mistoso are brilliant. They're very similar to the other pieces in Claret's lineup, including the Soprano and the Cantheros. The balance is cylindrical and it's easily viewed on the dial side, which is semi-skeletonized. The bridges are designed in homage to Charles X. There are clear sapphire bridges that allow full viewing access to the entire gear train, including the balance assembly and the differential setup. It's a very, very visually appealing watch. What the Mistoso demonstrates is the capacity of Christophe Claret in his workshop to identify a problem and come up with a solution that makes sense, that's groundbreaking. Very few companies in the world today have that capacity, have that ability. Christoph displays it absolutely brilliantly with the Mistoso when it comes to the detonic escapement in the wristwatch.